everyone and welcome back to my channel. Pregnant Rihanna continues to honour her grandmother's memory, most recently with a sweet Instagram tribute to her on her anniversary of her passing. Rihanna's grandmother passed away from cancer on July 1st, 2012. Since then, Rihanna keeps her grand grand dolly ever present through the foundation she created in her honour. She uses her memory as motivation to always work hard in an effort to continue making her grandmother proud. The two were very close and Rihanna would visit her at New York's Memorial Sloan Kettering, where she was hospitalised for cancer treatment. Rihanna would post updates about her grandmother's condition, constantly showering her grandmother with affection and compliments. Rihanna's grandmother, who she referred to as Grand Grand Dolly, died of an unspecified cancer. Since then, Rihanna has continuously grieved the loss of her grandmother, honouring her through the Clara Lionel Foundation, which Rihanna created in 2012 in her grandparents' namesake. Their mission in being to support and fund groundbreaking education and emergency response programs around the world. Rihanna also donated 15 million US dollars from this non-profit to help mental health services. Her activism and work to help other people in part is due to her wanting to honour her grandmother. In her original 2012 post announcing her grandmother's passing, Rihanna said, Goodbye, Grand Grand Dolly. Get your beauty rest until I see you. Coping with a loved one's cancer diagnosis looks different for everyone, especially if you lose your loved ones to cancer. For Rihanna, losing her grandmother to cancer provoked more activism and motivation to make her grand grand dolly proud. However, it's clear from her Instagram post that the loss of sadness can linger for years after losing a loved one. This was also the case for Camilla Le Caspi, who lost her mum to breast cancer when she was in high school. In a previous interview with Survivor Net, Camilla discussed the tragedy of losing a parent as a teenager and how that affected her life thereafter. Therapy saved my life. I was dealing with some intense anxiety and depression by that point, says Camilla, about the feeling she had after her mother passed away. Going to therapy allowed her to understand what she'd still had in her life to keep her chin up. She describes her mother as having been very creative and Camilla used that to motivate her writing, which was an outlet for her. She attended Princeton University, writing for the school magazine. She used her mother's passing as a means of inspiration for poetry, fiction or whatever else that she wrote. Camilla, like Rihanna, is trying to use the passing of her loved one as a motivator for a greater purpose, keeping their memories alive. Thanks for listening. For more celebrity news, please like, comment and subscribe.